Hello students, this is Matias and we are going to start unit number one, the relief of Spain. We are going to study relief, mountains, the relief of Spain and also the highest mountains in Spain. The first thing we have to study is the relief and this is the definition. It's the combination of landscape features in an area of land. And there are two types, the coastal landscape, which is near the sea, and the inland landscape, which is far away from the ocean or the sea. Features in a coastal landscape. A gulf is a large area of sea that extends into the land. And the cape is the opposite, is an area of land that extends into the sea. There are two more features in a coastal landscape. An island is an area of land surrounded by water. A group of islands is called an archipelago. And a peninsula is an area of land surrounded by water on all sides except one. It is connected to the coast by an isthmus. Features in an inland landscape. A mountain is an elevated area that is higher than the surrounding land. And a valley is an area of low land between mountains. Two more features in an inland landscape. A plain is a flat area of low land and a hill is a natural elevation of low land. And now we are talking about mountains. We can see mountains alone, we can see a group of mountains which is mountain range and a group of mountain ranges which is a mountain chain. Now we are going to learn the parts of a mountain. The foot is the bottom of the mountain. The sides are called slopes and the peak is the highest part of a mountain. So remember, food, slopes, and peak. Let's go now with the relief of Spain. Here you are a map of Spain, a physical map, and you can see different colors. They represent the altitude in each uh, part of Spain. The green ones are the lowest parts, they are near the sea level, and the brown ones are the highest parts. What features can we see in Spain? We can see a plateau, which is called uh, the Meseta Central. We can see mountains inside, outside and around the Meseta Central. There are two river basins in Ebro and Guadalquivir and finally two archipelagos, Baleares and Canarias. What are the highest mountains in Spain? In Cordillera Cantabrica, in the north of the Meseta Central, we've got Torre Ferrero. In Pirineos, between Spain and France, Aneto. In Sistema Ibérico, on the Meseta Central, we have got Moncayo. In Sistema Central, which divides the Meseta Central into two parts, we've got Almanzor. And finally, Sistemas Béticos. These mountain chains are in the south, the Cordillera Subbética is inland, and the Cordillera Penibética is near the coast. And we have Mulacén as the highest mountain. End of the lesson, students! Was it boring? Did you like it? I leave you meditating, thinking about it, and see you in the classroom. Bye-bye.